Hey everyone, so um, I have a package from the cubicle.com, so let's open it. Um, I think I have a lot of angstrom MGC items here, so I got an angstrom one, but it's in a max bag for some reason. Um, so what we have is an Angstrom MGC 6x6, an Angstrom MGC 2 Elite, and an Angstrom MGC 5x5, and a Angstrom MGC 4x4. Um, this is the receipt. This is not important. I think the cubicle's been running out of bags because the last time when I ordered the Yo Cube, that it was in a Mystic bag. So, yeah, anyways, let's start with the smallest, which is the 2x2. Two two. Okay, so it's a YJ MGC 2x2, Angstrom. Um, my current, I bought this for a competition. Well, I'm trying to get faster at 2x2, two two, so this is my current ring, the YJ MGC normal, but I got the Elite because I heard it's good. Here's a cube stand, and here's the cube itself. So this is my um, first Angstrom cube. So. I heard angstrom cubes are pretty fast. I can get this plastic wrap open. That would be nice. This is my first cubicle premium cube besides the Yo cube. I usually don't order premium cubes, but. Okay, so here's the cube with the Angstrom logo. Outside it isn't very loopy. Inside you can see some of the Angstrom Dignitas and Gravitas. So yeah, first comes. Okay. This feels very simu similar um, to this cube. I think this is a bit bigger also. But I prefer the smaller size. Um, it's a bit sluggish as expected. Um, so I'll definitely do a couple of solves to break it in later. Um, but yeah, it will probably be my main after breaking. Um, but. I hope it gets faster after I do some solves. So, here in the accessories box, we have just some magnets, some springs, and a screwdriver. Um, but, yeah, let's move on to the next cube. This is a nice cube stand. All right, so our next cube is the well, Angstrom MGC 4x4. I bought this for a competition um, because a lot of people are switching from the ASU to the MGC 4. Um, and this is my current name, the ASU WRA. And yeah. So I'm going the next competition I'm going to. Um, it's Pretzel Mania 2022. It's in like I believe early September, and there's four x four in it. And I've been practicing four x four a lot, and I got this cube. So um, here is the I get the 
There's the accessories box. And here's an Angstrom card by Kukla.com. Here's another cube stand. And here's the MGC floor. Um, so for size, this is a bit bigger than the um, Aosu. And yeah, the color shades, um, I would say that Aosu's are a bit darker. And these are a bit lighter, which I prefer. So yeah. How do I get this? Okay. So, so it's the Angstrom logo on it here. Um, yeah, it's a bit. Um, so I'm first going to do first turns. Oh, wow, this is very slow. This has a lot of lube in it. Like, when I just opened this up, I felt some lube go onto my arms. Um, but it feels, it feels pretty crunchy. Um, it feels pretty soft also. Um, this will probably need a lot of breaking. This is my first MUG4. Um, but for turning, compared to the Aosu, um, this is a lot faster, obviously. It also feels like some bit crunchy. They feel similar, similar, um, except this is drenched in lube. It's not too loopy outside, but let's see corner cutting. It's actually pretty good um, compared to the Aosu. It might be like a teeny bit better. Um, but yeah, moving on to the next cube is the Angstrom MGC5. So, I've been, I average around three to two minutes on 5x5. Five five. I know I'm really slow at 5x5. Five five. Um, but like just this week, I started like actually practicing. So I'm getting better. And I've been really enjoying 5x5. Five five. If you haven't learned 5x5, five five, I suggest you should really learn it. It's really fun. Um, so this is my current main, the MGC5. Um, but I wanted to get an Angstrom one. Um, it's a setup because I don't know how to set up 5x5s. Five five. Or I'm not really good at setting, setting up cubes. I just put some DNM 37 in it and just done. So, yeah. Also, thanks to the cubicle for sending this to me. Not sponsored, by the way, I just bought this. Okay, so, um, here's the 5x5. So, 
um, first trend, I guess. It's really, how do I say this? It's gummy. It's very gummy. Um, and it feels really similar to the 4x4, except this is a bit more sluggish, but hopefully it'll probably get faster um, with some breaking. Um, I hope this will become my main. And for corner cutting, compared to my five, other 5x5, five five, five, it's probably, it's about the same actually. Um, so, this is a bit more like glossy since I've used it more. This is also glossy, but it's like less. Um, I'm just gonna feel all of these together. So, um, the two by two is definitely the least sluggish out of all of them. But, anyways, this is very slow right now, but it's expected to be faster. But, yeah, I would recommend, if you want, if you're starting out with 5i5, I would recommend, really recommend this cube, like the MVC5. It's probably the best 5i5 five five out there. Um, and it's really cheap also. So, moving on from that. Um, moving on from this is the last thing. The Angstrom MGC 6x6. Um, and a lot of Angstrom MGC cubes, right? Um, it, so... I have not turned to 6x6 in my life. I do not know how to do 6x6. I hope I'll learn how. So, I bought it. Um, so, it should come with the cube stand as usual. And get this. Okay, so first time I turned to 6x6, I don't know how to solve one. 5x5 five five is the biggest cube I know to solve, so Ingstrom logo, so um, first turns. Okay, this is slow. Um, I'm not used to these pieces being so small, wow. Um, I think I know the parody algorithm, right? It's, I don't want to mess it up, so I'm not going to try. It's like the same parody 4x4 algorithm, but with these moves and these moves, I think. But yeah, I hope I can learn how to solve 6x6. Um, but yeah. Oh my god. I can't, I, I, I thought it would pop like a couple seconds ago, but anyways, so I guess that's all for today's video, um, so yeah, I don't usually do unboxing, this might actually be my first unboxing, but anyways, um, I would really recommend this 2x2, two two. it's really good it feels it's basically this but it feels a lot more stable and i would also recommend the 4x4 it turns really well and yeah i might make a review on one of these after it 
I break them in. But yeah, that's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed.